I'm a proud graduate of UC. And it wasn't that long ago that I stood here as a student. About 20 plus years ago, during the first budget cuts that UC faced and Governor Wilson uh, implemented. And during that cut, there were promises. The promises were, to students, because I remember them very, very clearly, is that yes, we're going to raise fees but we're going to make sure we increase Cal grants, we're going to increase funding so that the fees go to the students who have the ability to pay and that the grants go to the students who need it to have the opportunity. So what we have 20 years later is what well, we got, the we got the fee increases, right? Did we get the fee increases? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we got plenty of fee, fee increases, but the Cal grant increases never came. So I'm proud to stand with many of my fellow legislators today to carry one of the many bills that goes to restoring the dream, the California dream, which simply states that as long as you work hard, you get into school, the state will make sure if you don't have the means to help cover some of those costs. So what my bill does, uh, 1364, is very, very simple targets Cal Grant B, it's the lowest income group in the system. Uh, a single student would have to make less than $17,000 a year. And we're restoring Cal Grant B to $5,900 a year. But what we're saying is moving forward is every year there should be a uh, cost of living increase for that scholarship. So that those students who again are the neediest students in our state, will make sure they have the opportunity, because it shouldn't have to matter whether or not you could afford college. The whole point is that you worked hard and you got into one of our systems, whether it's the community college level, the CSU level, or the UC level, so that we can make sure to preserve that California dream, not, for our, not only for our children, but all of our grandchildren.